she the jealous boss. See why you talking to that girl? When I talk, she goes to talk back. So both of us they run now I'm out. I can't snap that. Everybody don't know, but you know I got a special spot to help you remember me. And every time you leave this spot, you know I get to see. Yeah. But she's bright like electric bulb, so everyone gets to see. And every. you're welcome back to my youtube channel mm -hmm. it's your girl minarmi yeah again with another bomb tutorial mm, this one is so bomb Ooh. and i'm loving my wig so much so if you're new to my channel you're most 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 definitely welcome grab some popcorn sit down relax click on the subscribe button join the saucy nation so today we're going to be going from basic to barbie and this is also an inspiratorial so we all that said let's jump right into this tutorial see ya hi loves you're welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl Minami again, another bomb tutorial. Yes, yes, yes. Today is an inspiratorial. I like us to talk about two things. Basically, first, I would like us to talk about challenging yourself or being able to take risks and move to the next level and try try out things. Because I realize that most of the times people are scared. To move from where they are they have built a home and they are so comfortable where they are that they are free to move to the next level they're like no I don't want to or you see a book you're about taking an exam and you're like wow see man only this book you're already disappointed even before starting something there's a saying that if you think positive or if you say positive things positive things are going to happen to you you cannot sit back and expect things to just happen you have to be able to push yourself do things and think positive that no i can do it don't be so comfortable in your situation don't be like no i'm okay like this or i can draw one line brows or a stick brow and i'm fine you don't want to learn this because you feel like you are already so comfortable in this what happened to having the best what happened to the idea of having the best is yet to come or having the best thing why are you comfortable being better when you can when you have the potential of being best try to push yourself to that next level don't be afraid to try and i'm also saying this to myself because there was one point in my life where i was so scared of taking risks like i'm like no or even in getting into a relationship i'm like no 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 I'm not dating again because I'm so scared of that you no know, this relationship I'm going to what if I get heartbroken again and all these things but at the end of the day in everything you find yourself you're going to learn something even if it works or if it doesn't work at the end of the day you learn something and at, at the end of the day you gain something at the end of the day there were the good times and there were the bad times because if you just sit back and do nothing or let your fear take over you completely trust me you're not going to go anywhere you're not going to gain anything maybe at the end of the day you might end up dying without getting to where you had to be because you were so scared of facing reality you were so scared of taking things taking the horn by its head try out new things be okay even if something fails you learn something from it you gain something that's going to help you in your next steps everybody the most successful people are not the, are not those that didn't take risks are not those that were so comfortable where they are the most ex successful people are those people who wanted to try out new things are those people who had that thirst those people who are like never satisfied they know they can do more they know that god has given them the potential they know they can get off their shell and stand up to the world they know they have something to offer and they don't just want to stay behind and be the basic person 
Have you ever asked yourself, like, what do I have to offer to the world? What is it that I'm going to do that the world is going to recognize me? Because at the end of the day, there are thousands, billions of people in the world, and everybody is trying to. I think everybody should try to be different. Everybody should try to polish themselves and be extra at what they do in order to be realized, um, recognized. Because if you find yourself in a class, you can either be noticed for something that is good or something that is negative. What do you want to be known for? Because in a world where there are billions of people, you cannot act like the average person. You cannot be basic and expect that people know you cannot be basic and expect that no they're going to in a world where everybody is black if there's one white that's a person that's going to be noticed so you have to do that thing you have to stand up today be different put your plans in god's hands pray and walk and the second thing i would like us to talk about is makeup shaming i got to realize and i've observed that there are a lot of men and women that are constantly criticizing those that wear makeup will be like no she's too artificial we don't even see her real face or if you want to get married to somebody make sure you take her to the beach first make sure you see her real face i just want to ask one question is it that you're getting married to that person's face or the person's personality because trust me i've seen thousands of people thousands of people who got married i've read about them and i've watched movies and documentaries of people who got married and they were not able to cope in that marriage does it mean if a girl is always make wearing makeup her wedding is not going to be successful or something because at the end of the day is the personality i've seen beautiful girls girls who if they just pass here like boys are going to go off but at the end of the day they had the worst characters so i don't see why other girls will be like no i'm just putting lipstick i'm natural okay boo get married invite us we're gonna come and we're still going to sleep because i don't see why other people will be throwing stones at others no she's too artificial trust me that girls who wear makeup and they have the best behaviors makeup doesn't define you makeup doesn't define your personality so if you want to get to know somebody get to know that person genuinely and don't judge people from their looks don't judge people because you see this person no because this person has tattoo the person is a bad person or because this girl has makeup she's this a boy once told me like when he came he was talking to me and he was like he asked me what do i do and i was like i'm a makeup artist and he's like um makeup artists are too exposed they are these they are artificial want to see our girls real faces are you even okay why would you just sit down because of somebody's job or something and you're judging that person what happened to to you getting to know that person like wow the world have just become so judgmental that people are constantly passing judgment on people and some people feel they are too good that and there are some other people that they are at this level no because this person wears makeup she's this or because this person does this she's this like we should stop judging others and we should work on ourselves don't dwell on the fact that no i'm better try to be best and stop trying to judge other people try to work on yourself don't base yourself on the idea that i'm good but try to base on yourself on the action and the idea that no i am working each day to become a better person i hope any of the things i've said helped you in one way or the, or the other if you did like this in tutorial do well to give it a thumbs up and as you saw during the video my foundation got broken that thing breaks my heart but i'm like hmm even if you're broken i'm going to use all the product that is left in the bottle till the end and guys hope you love this look do well to try to get yourself off that basic level it's not okay to be basic it's not okay to stay comfortable in where you are you can always push yourself you can always do better until you die you have the potential to be better than your yesterday so do good stay well be blessed i love you all so much if you are not subscribed to my channel do well to subscribe it's absolutely free and it means a lot to me i love you all so much See ya. Enjoy. Have a blast.